Welcome back to the Kitagawa Europe Focus Channel. My name is Hamish Walker. Joining me today is Safar. We also have a third member of the team who's Kobo the robot. Yes, Hamish, it's beginning to look a bit more crowded with Kobo and all this equipment. Um, so what are we showcasing today? Well, much of the equipment we're showcasing here today is already very well known to the market, including our rotary tables with work folding. We also have Kobo, who is a UR5V universal robot. But the product we're focusing on today is the Kitagawa Standard Robot Gripper, which is currently attached to Kobo. Ah, I see. So robot grippers are normally used to assist in automating many different industries. Exactly. These grippers are ideally suited to handling metal work pieces of 0.5 kilograms up to 15 kilograms. But what I wanted to stress at this stage is these grippers are for the metal cutting industry only. So not for food preparation or something like that? No, exactly. Kitagawa are definitely metal cutting specialists. Wow, so ultra specific in what they're designed for, which must make them exceptionally good at what they do. Yes, Kitagawa is drawing from masses of experience with its chuck design and is also an expert in the material that these grippers are manufactured from. Okay, so how does the experience and expertise help with the design? Well, it gives these grippers essentially three major advantages. Hamish, I'm going to count you in. What's the first advantage? Well, due to Kitagawa's experience with steel and aluminium, it means we've been able to manufacture the grippers to be incredibly lightweight. Mm. Um, and the benefit being? Well, when you're selecting an efficient automation cell, sometimes the smallest difference in weight can mean the difference between selecting a small or a large and very expensive uh, automation cell. So potentially a massive saving opportunity, and I've always liked the sound of that. <laughs> so what's the second advantage? Continuing on from this first advantage, this material expertise allows Kitagawa grippers to grip with considerably higher gripping force. Which will enable the gripper to hold heavier work pieces. Perfect. And the third advantage? Well, most importantly, our grippers maintain a high level of accuracy over a long period of time. Let me guess, due to the good material knowledge within Kitagawa. Yes, and from an exhaustive uh, testing program, Kitagawa have been using these grippers in real world environments for the past 10 years. We've also conducted destructive uh, testing to ensure the grippers' accuracy will last. Destructive testing, what does that involve? Well, we've actuated these grippers up to 5 million times in test environments um, and continually tested to ensure the accuracy will last. Okay, so reliable then. Wow, Hamish, I'm beginning to realise that these grippers are tough little guys. So, Hamish, what have you got Kobo demonstrating for us today? So we have the MK200 over here and the Swift Clamp AHK63 clamping head. So we're simply showing uh, Kobo the robot with the gripper picking and placing a few work pieces. We are showing today a particular setup using standard Kitagawa grippers along with a work holding system that uses a standard interface between the gripper jaws and the work holder. In this case we're using Swift Clamp but there are many other concentric devices or other work holder systems out there. Okay, so why is this point important? So this setup allows you to have one workpiece so it is not necessary to change the gripper jaw therefore keeping your gripper weight and cost at a minimum. Excellent. So if I want to automate the system so that I can handle multiple different size shaped work pieces, what do I do? Well, Kitagawa have a solution for this that we'll showcase at a later date. Okay. So tell me more about the standard gripping systems. So you can see the Kitagawa NTS uh, series, which is the standard series of grippers. Mm -hmm. We have the two jaw version here yeah. and the three jaw. So these are perfect for round or regular shaped work pieces. However, if it is very high gripping force you require, then we can offer the NPGT series of grippers that have up to 58% higher closing force compared to the NTS series. That is a serious improvement. And also, this design, it is so thin as well. But in addition to this, the gripper can also be specified with a built-in measuring system to cut out or significantly reduce the amount of CMM checking required and automatically improve your machining process. Whoa, well I think there's enough here to showcase another day. Sure, there is a lot of information here. Yeah, well listen, thank you so much for introducing me to the wonderful Kitagawa Gripper and I look forward to hearing more another day. Thanks, Sophia. Thanks for watching the Kitagawa Europe Focus channel and we'll see you again next time.